Okay, so today's pathetic word is going to be leading while wounded. Okay, leading while wounded. Okay, okay. okay. So where we are right now, we are at Deuteronomy chapter 34, verse 7. And it says, Moses was 120 years old when he died. His eye was undimmed and his vigor unabated. And the people of Israel wept for Moses in the, plain, in the plains of Moab 30 days. Then the days of weeping and mourning for Moses were ended. Okay. So where we are right here is. Moses has died, Akaye, and Moses is 120 years old. Akaye, and the children and the people of Israel wept for 30 days, Akaye, for Moses. And then I say, and after that, it was ended. And then I say, that was their crying period, their grieving period, Akaye. Listen, and then they say, they have been in the wilderness, and then I say, with Moses for 40 years. Akaye and cried for Moses. For 30 days. Mourn for Moses for 30 days. Wept for Moses. Grieved for Moses for 30 days. But then it was time to get up and move on. So listen, Akaye in Joshua chapter 1. And I say, uh, yeah, I see. It says, after the death of Moses, the servant of the Lord, the Lord, Akaye, the servant of the Lord, the Lord said to Joshua, the son of Nun, Moses' assistant, Moses, my servant, is dead. Now, therefore, arise, go over this Jordan, you and all this people, into the land that I am giving to them, to the people of Israel. Every place that the sole of your foot will tread upon, I have given to you, just as just as I promised to Moses. Okay. So listen. The people of Israel have grieved. They, I say, have grieved for Moses for 30 days. They, I say, but just that quick. Okay. Just that fast. Okay. Moses' mantle has now been passed to Joshua. Hey. Yeah. Now, Joshua is still wounded. Akaye. We all know, Akaye, when you are close with someone and you love somebody. I say 30 days, Akaye, you are not done grieving. I say, I say, Akaye, but life must go on. Eh. The commission, Akaye, must go on. Akaye, God's purpose, Akaye, still must be fulfilled. It still must go on. So Joshua had to lead while wounded. Leading while wounded. Hey, listen. We don't got time, okay, to cry about what happened. I say we don't got time, okay, to still be grieving, mourning, weeping, okay. Over what happened in the name of Jesus. All the day I said today, I said we have to learn to lead Akaye while wounded. Our family is counting on us. Our children is counting on us. Our bloodline is counting on us. Hey, to lead while wounded. All the day I said today, I said give God a yes. No excuses. All the day I say no more excuses. Life is always going to be lifing. Hey, it's this quote that says, Life be lifing, but God be God too. Yeah, da, 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 I said, I said, that means life is always going to happen. Hey, but God is always going to be God. Hey, there's always going to be something okay, hey, that grieves you, that hurts you, that's an obstacle that gets in your way. Yeah, da, 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 I said, I said, but in the name of Jesus. You're going to overcome. Hey, are you willing to lead while wounded? 